Hello. In this video, we are going to discuss another MATLAB code. So the difference between this MATLAB code and the one I, uh, that I have already posted is uh, in the last MATLAB code, the format was uh, first it, it asked for all the input according to the question that is being given. After we write the after we given the input, it gives us certain options and it asks us to type some commands in order to get those particular answers. But if we don't want all those options, we don't want to type anything. And if we want directly all the answers, this code is the answer. So in this code, it just asks for the input values, basically all the stresses, all the properties, only that much we have to enter. And after we have entered the input values, it directly gives all the answer to the key parameters that are being asked in the question itself. We don't have to write any command for that. So I have just modified the previous MATLAB code itself. And uh, this question is basically for example 2.7 of the book that is being mentioned in the description. So let's run this command. So let's see the command once. So basically the same command that we have used, just minor differences. And one thing you will notice is there is no section for displaying any options. So I have removed those options command. So now let's run it. So the value of first stress applied is 2 megapascal. Second stress is minus 3 megapascal. Fourth is 46, 1 e 9, 10.3 e 9, 0 0.28, 7 0.17 e 9. All these values, all the property values are being taken from table 2.1. Now the angle of lamina in example 2.7 is 60 degree and now if I press enter all the all the answers which is uh, which is what we need according to the question will be displayed without need of typing any further commands. So let's see enter. Now here we can see all the answers are being displayed and we don't have to write any command to display these. So global strain, local strain, local stress, principal normal stress, principal normal stress minimum, maximum stress angle, maximum shear stress, maximum shear stress angle, principal strain maximum, principal strain minimum, its angle, maximum shearing strain and maximum shearing angle. All these values can be cross checked uh, with the example 2.7 given in the book. The book I have also mentioned in the description. You can also download it from there. Also, this code is being made available and the link will be shared in the description as well. You can download it and run it for yourself. Thank you.